I'm a little bit biased, so I would say where I'm from, Kofili Castle, is a, um, a big castle. I think it's one of the biggest in Europe, but uh, it's in my town in, in Wales. Rugby, yeah, of course, this is uh, uh, installed into you at a young age. Every school will play rugby, um, and I was no different. Uh, it's the first game that I played. You have to like it being Welsh. And do you think that rugby is more popular than football? No, I think not. <laughs> but uh, we've worked hard to try and uh, to try and get football um, above rugby. But rugby is uh, a massive part of Welsh history, um, tradition. It'll forever be like this, and you know I'm very very supportive of uh, the rugby team. Uh, Cardiff. Yeah, I came through Cardiff. I started at Cardiff when I was eight years old. So. Um, you know, I owe a lot to Cardiff and, you know, the people that helped me progress and come through as a professional footballer. So, yeah, they'll forever be my team. Uh, Cardiff Swansea. This is a big game, massive game. Yeah, I've been lucky enough to play it once and uh, we won. So, yeah, I was very happy and the fans as well. So, yeah, it's a big, big derby. Um, at the moment, in the national team, there's a song called Amar Heed, so all the fans and, um, are singing this now in the game, which is you know, all a traditional song, which is, uh, typifies the Welsh spirit and um, you know, history. So yeah, I think this song will uh, sort of typify Wales at the moment. In the autumn, when the leaves are starting to come down, a bit of colour, um, still the, the weather's okay sometimes, <laughs> uh, a bit fresh, but yeah, it's nice. I think uh, it's a nice time of the year to go and visit. I think one of the rugby days in Wales is a brilliant day. Going to the stadium, um, spending the whole day in Cardiff, and then you go and watch the rugby match, is a great, great day out. So. Um, this is an event that, yeah, I would suggest you go and do. Oh, we have like these little cakes called Welsh cakes, um, which are, yeah, little thin sort of cakes that you have like with a nice cup of tea or something, some raisins inside and some sugar on top and yeah, if you have a sweet tooth, yeah, of course, this is uh, something that I'd recommend trying. Gareth Bale, you have um, Tom Jones. The Stereophonics, the band. Famous actors, um, Mr. Sheen, who did the speech for Wales a few weeks back, which was very good. Like crimson thunder, a red storm is coming to the gates of Qatar. It crackles with the spirit of 58. Yeah, you have some, yeah, some really famous people at the top of their professions. It's not like London or anything like that. So uh, no, you can um, you can go to Wales and have a good time on on anything really. So it's a very beautiful part of the world with a lot of different you know um, places to go and see landscapes you know we have the coastal line um, just need to try and get a good week of weather <laughs> <laughs>